the number one killer of women, heart disease, is in the spotlight tonight at ABC7. One of our own, reporter Jennifer Donlan, knows plenty about it. Last night, she was honored in New York City by Women's Day magazine with its Red Dress Award. Jennifer is live in the Seven on Your Side Help Center now to tell us more about women and heart disease. Jennifer? And Maureen, if I may, you look beautiful in your red. Uh, Maureen, you know what? The phones are ringing off the hook down here in the ABC Seven on Your Side Help Center. We have cardiologists from across our area answering the phones, taking these critical questions as we fight back against the number one killer of women, which is heart disease. It kills more women than all cancers combined. And as you know, at 36, I had a heart attack and I am so blessed to be here to talk to you about it. And one of the people who's been keeping me alive is my own cardiologist, Dr. Elizabeth Ross. Thank you so much. She's been answering the phones. You have no idea what a special treat this is, that she's answering the phones because she's just the bomb. Okay, I said it. She's the bomb. <laughs> so what kind of calls have you been getting? We've been getting exactly the kind of calls we had hoped to get from women who are having symptoms. They're not sure if they're important. And we've tried to be encouraging them to be proactive about their health and get those symptoms evaluated. One of the things that you often talk to me about is the fact that if you have questions, pose them to your doctor. And you've also always encouraged me to go do research and come back and ask you questions. Have you found that women are afraid to sort of speak up and say they don't want to be a nuisance or? I think women sometimes are afraid to raise a symptom that they think may not be important, but I think that women should be aware that they are at risk for heart disease and there are things they can do proactively to keep themselves healthy. Um, what might be a risk or a symptom that somebody's sitting around that they're not really thinking that they should be seen by a doctor, but it's something that they should probably go in and see someone about? I think women who are having problems with an activity that they used to be able to do easily, either it's making them very tired or short of breath, or they're having um, more problems with fatigue when they do their regular exercise program, need to be aware that could be a heart symptom. Okay. Thank you so much. I'm going to let you get back to the phones. Okay. They're only open for 15 more minutes. Um, call the number 703-236-9220. Again, 15 more minutes. Get your calls in. Very important. Thank you so much, Jennifer.